I have a lot of things I'm, I'm, I'm doing personally. From the political side, my mission currently, um, you know, it's good if I see all these things, but we know one is too small a number to achieve anything great. So my mission is to raise as many people with similar values. You know, when Mr. Bolaji was talking, well, he said values and culture. You know, values eventually would affect the way you think. The way you think will affect your emotions. Your emotions will affect the way you act. Your action over time will become your habit and your behavior. And then when all of us behave the same way, it becomes a culture. It's acceptable. But it started with values. So we need to get back into the system to change the values. Currently, we're running um, a John Maxwell um, IE program with 16 values. We are teaching it in the school system. Because the public schools, unfortunately, we used to say the homes should train people. We used to say the school should train people. Neither one of them seems to be trained people. And then we let them go into the society and pick values from wherever. So we have to be intentional about values. And so that, that's one of the programs I'm doing, taking values into secondary school. Because I believe that way we can start to transform them. From the political side, I have a political show. I bring in you know, politicians or whatever. Again, to demystify this whole, is not for Christians, is not for people, is not for a lie. It's a lie. They've said it for too long so that we will not go there. When I was campaigning, they told me in this place we use jazz. I said, my the power I carry is more than the jazz. They will tell you, oh, there is insecurity. It's to scare us away. Because if you don't come there, we will continue to inhabit the place. But enough of that. If you love the country so much, you will be willing to do something about it. You know, so for me, I, I, I mean, if you know me, second this one, I'm the last person you consider for politics. If, if, if there are six of, 600 of us in case, if you were going to pick a politician, I would be 500 and it is something. I did not look like it. But I knew something in my heart. And that's the same message I give to everybody. If there is that conviction in your heart, you have to follow it through. You understand? Everything else comes back. So in the political class, we're educating, we're enlightening. I have mentoring programs. I have a lot of things I'm doing just to build people with like values that will go there for the right reasons. And then from the younger class, we're trying to change the value system of those in our school system. So hopefully, they too will start to see things differently and not differently.